Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a really fun video for you guys. I'm going to go ahead and show y'all my new obsessions. So go ahead and keep on watching. Perfect. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are back with the wig reviews and it is a dual wig review because Zara Hollywood went ahead and released a new collection and it is the tie-dye Beyond Lace collection and today we're going to be reviewing the unit Ben. You'll see, y'all will see a better view of the wigs but I have them in the color tie-dye black and she has this beautiful rainbow type of color going on. And then I also have her in the color tie-dye ash. So it's a black unit with some gray going on. And all I can say is I am so excited to review these. These are definitely something different, especially the way the color blend is. So let's go ahead and put these on. I might do just a little voiceover, tell you guys the specs of the unit and everything else like that. But for the most part, since it's two wigs, honey, we're gonna go ahead and show you the wigs. <laughs> so let's go ahead and get started. All right, so here is a better look at what the unit is looking like. This is the info card. And here is a look at the back. Oh my God, I just opened the rest of this and the weight, oof. I am obsessed with this color. I cannot wait. I cannot wait. Hold on. Okay. Okay. Oh my lord. Oh my god. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Y'all. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. <gasps> like, for real, the way that this color blend. Oh my god. I'm obsessed. Oh my god, I'm obsessed. This is what the inside cap construction is looking like. We have two combs right here, a good deep parting space, and then as well as a comb and adjustable straps right in the back. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and show y'all exactly what I did to customize this unit. And it literally was just like two easy steps, y'all. I took a little bit of my got to be glued and a little bit of hair out in the front. I went ahead and applied it right there just so that when I cut the hair to do these little baby hairs, it didn't go ahead and get lost in the unit. Just made things a lot easier. So then I went ahead and cut them and used my edge brush to kind of smooth them down, make it look a little bit more natural rather than just like a straight blunt hairline. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's what I went ahead and did. I went ahead and added a little bit of my foundation as well to the part just to make things look a little bit more natural. But y'all, this was like the easiest wig install ever. And just, y'all y'all gonna hear me ranting and raving, but just look at that color. And with the fact that summer is coming up, it's gonna be all hot. This is like the perfect length, 11 inches. It ain't gonna be all sweaty on your back, getting all tangled, honey! Yes. Okay, so I just wanna interrupt this little voiceover real quick because I wanna say, if you have been following my channel for a while, you know that I tend to do like medium length to long length type of units. And... <laughs> Let me just say, honey, this... Okay, and these nails, like everything's popping. Everything's popping. The color blend of this one, like, I haven't even tried on the other one yet. The color blend of this, like, please just appreciate it. Please just take it all in because I am so obsessed with this entire look. After this, yeah, girl, I'm gonna take some photos up in this, but, um, bitch. Like, for real, I love everything about this. Um, what I did with the front was just kind of lay a little bit of baby hair down, kind of make it look a little bit more natural. I didn't go too crazy because I want to show you guys it doesn't take that much effort at all. Um, for the parting space, I just went ahead and put just a tiny bit of concealer. 
And the trick with that to make it like really nice and clean is I put a little bit of product like on something flat like this and then literally just stamp it right on and it's so, so easy. I was gonna try to show you guys that on camera but your girl's blind and I don't got contacts and this monitor doesn't really... I'm blind so I had to, <laughs> I had to like go in the bathroom and do it but... Honey, who is she? Who is she? Also, I brushed her out just a bit to see if there's any type of fallout, anything like that. So far, I haven't got any type of tangling, and I feel like the luster on this unit is like perfect. It's not too shiny where it looks, honey, like a Party City wig, okay? But, um, I'm feeling myself, okay? I'm feeling myself. I'm not even playing with y'all. Alright, so this next unit we're trying is also been in the color tie-dye ash. And as you can see, she's more of a neutral type of tone, but still has that nice little like highlight of color with the dark root and you know dark ends. Y'all, I am living. Like I keep looking at myself, honey, and I I just can't. Okay, and so this is a color comparison of the tie-dye black versus the tie-dye ash color and you still get that dark root and dark tip but instead it's got a mixture of like blondes and grays in it so I'm gonna go ahead and customize this one do everything I did to this one to this and try this on so we can go ahead and compare Okay, honey, this ash glue, like, what? Y'all, this color, I am freaking living for it. Honestly, I'm gonna have to start getting some shortcuts, cause your girl is looking cute, okay? Look, just look at this, just look. I honestly, I might have to look at some other colors in this because Girl, they have a long list of colors. They have a tie-dye orange, a tie-dye parade, a tie-dye plum. All right, y'all, that is it for today's video. Let me just say, hold up, hold up, hold up. A round of applause to Zuri Hollywood for putting out these bomb ass units because, honey, I'm literally obsessed uh, okay obsessed I can't I really I don't know which one I like better to be honest like mm, I really don't so girl let me know which one you are feeling more leave a comment down below and who knows you might just get shouted out in my next video but before I end this video I do want to go ahead and give a shout out to life being Vic thank you so much girl for supporting my channel and commenting and interacting on my videos but anyway <laughs> that is it for this video be sure to follow Zuri Hollywood if you guys want to go ahead and purchase any of these units I will leave their information down in the description box below so be sure to check them out anyways that is it for today's video guys if you liked it don't forget to leave your girl a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next one